If someone said to you at the start of the season, you boys will be top at the end of November, would you have laughed at them? Yeah, definitely. Oh, I can't can't even deny that. Uh, if you, you look at where we was this time, this time last year, and and the change that, um, that, that that's gone on, and it's it, it's strange to think that that we're top top of the the best league in the world. You basically got the same squad. What's changed? I can't. I, I won't be even start to tell you what, what what's changed around around the place. Obviously, we, we've had the new manager, but even he's come in and he's, he's not sort of gone and, and changed a whole whole lot. He's kept the same backroom staff, added his sort of Italian Italian spark on, on things and and his uh, and his Italian tactics, and it's it's just sort of like chalk and cheese as to, to what, what it was. Yeah, well you said Italian tactics, you're scoring a lot of goals. So the Italians are known for defending, but what, what do you mean by Italian tactics? It's made us more sort of compact. We, we were before probably a bit, bit spread out and more like a basketball team uh, uh, as we was sort of, there was gaps everywhere uh, uh, and whatever. So I think with, with what he's done now, he's made us a more compact and, and solid unit. He's quite a funny guy, isn't he? I see him when you kept a clean sheet, took you all for pizza. He's quite a character, isn't he? He is, yeah, and I think that, that, that helps massively. We're just enjoying ourselves and, and it's a good place to be right now. Cool, how does he wind the players up? Any pranks that he's played that you can mention on camera? If you, say if you mess up in training, if you're sort of not on the ball, it, it's just little phrases like he'll, he'll shout dilly ding, dilly dong, and <laughs> like, wake up, wake up, and um, just stuff like that. It, it just, just sort of lightens the mood a little bit. Yeah. Uh, you personally, mate, you've been on fire this season, touch me. Um, what did you put that down to? I think the confidence that the, the managers had uh, in me since the start of the season. I've had a couple of bad games, but he's le left me in there. And before I was probably playing in games, I'm thinking if if I don't sort of set up a chance or score a goal in this game, I'll, I'll probably be dropped next game. But whereas with, with this manager, he's, it, it, even if you're just doing the, the hard, gritty work, he, he appreciates that. Has your game changed from when you were at Villa to, to now? I'd say it has, yeah. Um, when I was at Villa, I was more sort of willing to take players on and. I um, don't know if I've lost my pace or, or what. I don't know what. I don't know what's happened, but I'm more now of um, I just like to get half a yard and uh, and whip a ball in and uh, and strikers. Everyone always says strikers love love crosses in the box, and, and if I can deliver that, then then fantastic. Your crosses have been compared to David Beckham's, and that's pretty cool, isn't it? It is, yeah. Um, Beckham was my idol, so. To, to be compared there is, is unbelievable. Yeah, he weren't bad, was he? No, he was all right. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, I've got to mention Jamie Vardy. Um, the record's been unbelievable, um, but I want to talk about his speech. That was rubbish. It was terrible, weren't it? Terrible. <laughs> he, he, had, he had the opportunity, like you seen Rooney's a few weeks back, it's unbelievable. Yeah. Like, he had the opportunity to, to sort of get out there. He knew it was on camera. Just, do something, do something unbelievable and a couple of, it was a sentence, weren't it? Cheers boys, wouldn't have been able to do it without all here, but um, the gaffer just said that he's going to put some beers on the coach in the plane. Yeah. Yeah. Most of the boys didn't even come back on the coach. <laughs> but no, yeah, that's something that I'm sure he'll work on for, for this week if he bags it. He's told me to call you Sharky. He did mention something yesterday. That you've got a nice nose. Yeah, I do. I can't see what's wrong with it. I think I think the, the press is, is terrible about it, but... <laughs> it just looks nothing like a shark fin. See, that's, that's what I've been trying to tell everyone, but... Is that a side Nah, it's fine. <laughs> He's, uh, he's come from Villa. I tried to I tried to lose the name, sort of come making the move over to Leicester. Football's a small world, isn't it? Like people talk. United this weekend. Is it going to be another eight goal thriller? I hope I'll take one nil right now. If you give me one nil, I'll take that. Um, but if we have to do it, have to win f five three, then then so be it. Just just three points, and uh, and we'll, we'll be happy. Yeah. Can Leicester win the Premier League? Yeah. Yeah, why not? Why not? Top Christmas. of the league. It's Christmas. Then. It's Christmas. Yeah, why, why can't we win the league? Absolutely. Brilliant. Top man. Thanks so much. Cheers. Thanks very much, mate. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> you feel dump. <laughs> <laughs> How did you
would you do that? That's unreal. I remember, don't get tricked on a match day. Brilliant.